last tip of the day, let's take a look at how we can mirror toolpath within one CNC. In this example, I've applied a climb cut profile operation to the part, a high speed pocket operation, and a peck drilling operation to all the holes. To mirror the toolpath, all you need to do is this. I'm going to hit the spacebar twice, quickly go to a CAD view. I'm going to select all the geometry by hitting Control A, Control Alpha on the keyboard. Then we're going to select our mirror tool and you can select a line or you can grid point snap a mirror line just like I'm doing here. One CNC will mirror the part and at this point we don't need to re-execute the machining operations we simply just need to re-pick. You can quickly do this by right hand mouse clicking and select re-pick path. Left click, left click the direction, hit the F3 key and right click and that's it. How about the pocket operation? Right click, repick path. Here we just need to left click and right click, and that's it. For the whole operation, right click, select repick path. Tell one CNC how you'd like to pick the geometry. I'm going to use arc center, and I'm simply going to select the holes in the order that I'd like to drill them. When we're finished, we can right hand mouse click, click finish, and that's it. We've now mirrored our toolpath. Why don't we take this into preview? We're going to right hand mouse click, select preview toolpaths. Here's our climb cut profile operation, high speed pocket operation, and here is our peck drilling on all the holes. All right, that's it for this tip of the day. Thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. And don't forget to click the subscribe button.